Hello sunshine and welcome back to another video. Today's video is a lot of fun. It's short and sweet again. I just have not had the energy to do anything this week. Um, I'm able to get up, do my little bit of Bible study, and then like do one little extra thing for the day and that's just it. I'm just so exhausted, but I'll be okay. I'm feeling better today. Um, but today the project was to get the living room tidied up and add some fun pops of color so i know you guys have been excited about our new living room makeover um and i finally got to get some new curtains and a beautiful rug so stay tuned if you want to see how we make over the living room i love how it turned out i think it is just marvelous and it really opens up the space let this be your sign to decorate however you want to, not what everybody else is doing. Because as you can see, I tried to do the neutral colors and it just, oh, it's so depressing in here. So definitely love the added color that we did and I hope you like it too. So just stay tuned and see how it turns out. What's it like to hold his hand when he tells you that you're all he wants and it's midnight oh. picked up that I wanted to so now we're going to take these curtains down because they are I, I just feel like I would really want a pop of color in here so um, I got some new curtains they were pretty cheap on Amazon they're blackout curtains because we have our TV right here and the blinds yeah the dog got in those blinds but um, make a really bad glare on the TV and we like the living room like this so far We'll probably move it in a few months um but anyway so i just wanted to pop a color in here that is my main thing i wanted to say so we are going to hang the new curtains and uh, of course take those down and probably put this panel these two in my um, son's bedroom because they're not torn up or anything but these are pretty grody the bad parts are tied up in a knot anyway so we're gonna hang the new curtains now and i'm out of breath from that small amount of work these are the curtains that i ordered um you can kind of see the color under the label but i was just showing you how they came packaged they're very good this is not sponsored in any way i will have these links below in case you like them and would like them for your home but um i'm so grateful my husband was home so that he could get these hung up it didn't take any time at all and it looks so much better y'all i can't wait for you to see On a side note, look at my huge child. He is 13, he'll be 14 in June, and I swear he's grown like four inches in a week. And I didn't think he was gonna get any taller, but he is going to tower over my husband and I, and I just think that's hilarious. What about y'all, do, do your kids go through growth spurts like that? And you're like, oh my gosh, I didn't know that was possible, but apparently it is. He's so big, y'all. Oh, and I forgot to mention, online these curtains looked a little bit lighter in color than what they are. So when I opened them, I was kind of leery about it because I was like, this is way darker than what I thought they were gonna be. But it turned out okay, um, thank goodness, because I hate doing returns. I'd rather let something sit on the counter and never use it than return the dang thing. I don't know why, it is what it is, that's who I am. Uh, anyway, so I'm really glad that the color turned out okay, so y'all let me know what you think. Never 
come down I will keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down This is the moment my husband realized, oh, the blinds are broke, broke. I have been looking for a rug for over a year. Over a year. We usually get ours at Lowe's. I think they're around $200. But I really wanted to find a cheaper one and one that I could throw in the washing machine if it got dirty because, let's face it, I've got four men in this household and a dog. Uh, it gets it gets messy. So, this one I found on good old Amazon. Y'all, it was $87. And I love it it is so soft and it's thin it doesn't slide around everywhere but just to make sure we did put it pretty deep under the couches um like i said it's washable you can spot treat it or you can just throw it in the washing machine um i think it'll be very forgiving with stains because of the beautiful pattern and it really is so soft and it's super thin so like it'll be easy to vacuum the um, robot vac does really good with it, so I just love it. I mean, isn't it beautiful? I absolutely love it. And do you see how well it works with the curtains? If they were a lighter color, I don't think it would have looked that good. So everything worked out, and I'm just so excited. And we love sitting in the living room now. My husband has always had trouble just sitting in here, and I have too, because it just feels like something is missing. And now it feels pulled together and like we're grounded, and it's just, it's just awesome, and I'm really glad I found such a great rug for such a great price. So I'll definitely link it below. Again, not sponsored in any way, but this is an awesome rug, and they have other designs if you don't like this one. For only $87, um, this is an 8x10, which 
all the stores here with 8x10 rugs are over $100. So I was just really excited about that price point because, you know, we're on a budget. But anyway, I hope you guys love the new rug as much as we do. And also, I know somebody's going to say it. I can't believe he's wearing shoes on that rug. They are brand new shoes. He's never worn them outside the house. So he was okay to walk on the rug. And you'll notice the curtains are dragging the floor. That's because uh, we actually argued over the length of curtains to order. I wanted a little bit shorter. He said this was the right length. So I was like, whatever, I don't even care. So I ordered the ones he said. And I mean, I know some people like them pooling in the floor like that. Um, I guess I'll just get used to it because I'm not gonna return them. Y'all know that's just not me. Anyway, so that's the story on those. I think eventually I do want a larger coffee table to put in here so like we can sit and do puzzles and stuff on it and I think I want a round one but for now we just have this small end table and instead of putting it in front of the couch I'm going to put it back here between the two I just think it looks better that way. And that wraps up today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope that you love the new look of our living room. It's amazing how just adding a few pieces can really change the atmosphere of the room. We love it in here now. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Again, I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you have any prayer requests below. I'll have everything linked in the description box if you're interested in it yourself. And I will see you in the next one. Be grateful, give grace, and God bless. What do you think, Rip? I like the coffee. Do you like it? I